I'd like to give a shout out to the newest member of the comment club. If you want to join the comment club, make sure you leave a comment below. What is going on guys? This is the Crans Melt here and we're back with another Madden 17 Ultimate Team video. And today we've got new cards in the game for Flashback Thursday. Seriously, EA. Just make it Flashback Fridays. Everybody wants that. Nobody wants Flashback Thursday. It doesn't make any sense. Are you going to make throwbacks when they come out Throwback Friday? Come on, man. Anyways, so we got a new set and a new 24-hour limited time card. Um, so here's the set card. Bennett. Martellius Bennett. And now let me say this card's nice. It's a good card, um, but it's a little bit overpriced in my opinion. Let's check it out. So right here, we got 81 speed, 83 run block. 86 catching, 84 catching traffic, 88 spec catch, which if you couple that together with the 6'6 height, definitely going to be an unstoppable beast in, um, in, in getting some touchdowns. So uh, the reason why I say this card is good but not worth it is because like Charles Clay, I feel like Charles Clay is an excellent card about the same. Maybe uh, you could compare them to also the 85 free Gronk. It's a little bit slower, but relatively it's, it's like the same card. Honestly, I think like, why would somebody pay 75 K for a Mar Martellius Bennett? If they have the free Rob Gronkowski, it just doesn't make any sense. I don't know how an 89 overall is very similar to an 85 overall. I'm a little confused. Let me know what you guys think of the card. Maybe you guys think it's an awesome card, and that could be true. Maybe maybe this is a card you got to have you're going to add to your team. Let me know. Next up, we got the 48-hour limited time card. And let me just say, we got Dante Hittner in the house. Uh, a lot of people call him that, and there's a reason. The dude's got massive amount of hit power on this thing. I don't like the card art. It's a little blurry. Like, maybe it's just my screen. I got two screens. It just looks blurry. I wish they would have uh, worked on it a little bit more, straightened it out a little bit, made it so it wasn't as blurry, but I don't, I don't know, man. <laughs> oh, well, it's just a card art. Let's check out the stats on this thing. 88 speed, 91 play rec, 88 zone coverage, 91 pursuit, 92 hit power. This dude's going to be laying the boom, forcing some fumbles. Uh, 88 acceleration, 76 man, and 87 tackle. Now, I will say this card, if you compare him to, um, like, legend um, Lawyer Malloy, Lawyer Malloy might be a little bit better. I don't really have anybody to compare him to other than, you know, base cards and, like, this 85 Lawyer Malloy, who I, I would say puts up a fight against... Dante Whitner, it's a okay comparison. Obviously, the Dante Whitner card's going to be better than this 85 overall. But I think if you compare Lawyer Malloy, like the, the set one, to this guy, I'm leaning more towards Lawyer Malloy. But definitely check it out. Let me know what you guys think. Is this card worth 421K? Me personally, I say no, but let me know what you guys think. All right, so today's packs are flashback packs. I was going to pull this, but I'm going to wait. If you guys want to see me pull it, drop a like on the video. If we can hit like 300 likes, I'll open it up tomorrow for the new Football Outsiders. If not, we might wait and see what bundle comes out on Saturday when these expire and maybe do those for the Team of the Week card. So let me know what you guys would prefer. If you'd rather have the Team of the Week pulls uh, with Saturday's bundle or rather me pull these tomorrow with the flat the flashbacks tomorrow let me know uh i'm, I'm up for whatever you guys want to see um but we're not going to get these uh you guys can go and get them if you want the topper is one flashback badge which you can also do the the solos and get it and two flashback collectibles so it's not really an excellent topper um it's all right i guess but we're going to come in here and we're going to do a 14 pro pack bundle i think pro packs are definitely the way to go when you're buying packs uh, so I'm gonna pull a 14 pro pack bundle here for you guys today and I want to let you guys know today's video is sponsored by mvpdraft.com link for that down in the description go sign up play some MVP draft with me video will be out tomorrow more uh, more information but it's just a little quick little quick shout out to them so they are sponsoring this video so thank you guys very much for that let's 
get in to this pack opening. 14 Pro Packs. We gotta get some flames. I would love to see a 48-hour Dante Whitner pull. Probably won't happen. I'm not expecting too much here, but we're definitely gonna jump in, see what we can get. Um, definitely would be nice to get something. Okay, Virgil Green, not a bad card. 75 overall, so nothing spectacular here. I started putting my tips into the set for the awards players. I think I'm at like 104 or something like that, so I definitely still have a ways to go. Um, how many do you guys have? You get one for every pack you pull, no matter what the pack is. Um, so if you guys, do you guys have a lot of them already? I know some people have already, like a lot of people have already done it. Um, people were asking me like, should I do that set? Should I do pro pack? Should I do the new set where it gives you, you know, three mutt tips in order to get a gold player? That's not a bad one, but I think the best value is doing the awards. If you're going to open up 250 packs in the next I don't know how long it's available in the next month or two months It didn't really have an expiration on it, uh, but if you plan on opening enough packs Definitely do the awards one. It, it, it's totally worth it because 250 packs For what's it gonna be like guaranteed 70k or more there's some cards that are worth like two or three hundred K I uh, like the Tyrod Taylor's worth a lot. I think Andre Johnson's worth a good bit. So if you can get one of those guys, you're going to make a lot of coins. But if you just opened up, I think it's like 25 tips and you get a pro pack. So that's not a bad one. Um, if you get a lucky pool and a pro pack, it'll be nice. But really, um, the value is, is if you do that, um, the big set and get the awards player pack. So you guys can really do whatever you want. But, uh, you know, people have asked what my opinion is on that. That's what I think. Um, definitely let me know what you guys think if it's better to do pro packs, you know Some people are gonna say yeah, it's definitely better if you get one elite pool You know you're already gonna be up, you know a decent amount But you have to go through and you have to sell anything for it really to be worth it So it really depends some people are gonna get lucky and get something nice um, From the awards pack some people are gonna get lucky get something nice um, From from the pro pack so really, you know it, it could vary you're not you're not really guaranteed to do well, I guess. Uh, still, I mean, 70K is not bad. Not bad at all. Or a starter for your team, you know. Really, either way. We got Josh Doxson right there. Um, this, this pack already has been pretty dry. We haven't really seen too much yet. Uh, hopefully, we do end up getting something. I think they boost up. Ooh, we got a Mutt Gear Visor. That's not bad. We'll be able to put that towards like a jersey or something. Unis. Um, hoping we get some color rush uniforms. Let me know if you guys are interested in color rush uniforms uh, I definitely want to do a video like breaking down or showing all the sets when they do add them in because I know they're gonna be adding them in soon I just don't know when another mutt gear visor. Um, I would love to know what the sets are gonna be I I'm assuming it'll be sets or it might be solos it like there's a, a large variety of things it could be I'm hoping all these mutt gear items are a part of it because I've been saving up I probably have like 25 or more that I've just been holding on to just in case I do have like the guaranteed 10 unique ones that you need to do some of the, like the better sets um, so it really just depends what the set is or if it's a solo or what it is to really show you how many you're gonna get also I have seen that there are chemistries on the um, the jerseys which is awesome because a lot of the um, a lot of the chemistries like I don't know if I have one in here but verts chemistry that's one where you have to have the gold coach to do it so the set or to the gold coach sets like two or three hundred K which is ridiculous people hike the prices up knowing that they're worth a lot so my recommendation is if you have one of those coaches sell it now sell it now because the prices on those coaches are about to drop i don't think it's really gonna matter which one you have but they're all gonna drop a little bit jason peters right there probably our best pool so far in this pack opening which has been really bad um let's let's uh let's try to just go backwards maybe that's a trick we just need to go back oh teddy bridgewater r.i.p this pack all right i think we're closing in on the end of the bundle yeah this is the last we gotta open up another. You can't give us the gold on the first, the first player of the last pack. We definitely gotta go in here. Actually, you know what? Let's be crazy. We're gonna pull one flashback pack. It's crazy. We're not gonna get anything great. Uh, wait, what's a guarantee? 
seven gold or better, two silver or better, and three team items, and uh, one flashback item. That's pretty cool. Okay, and this will fill up our binder. We're gonna have to make some binder space after this, but it'll be the end of the video, so it's okay. Let's go ahead and get, oops, get this pack right here. Let's see what we're gonna get. All right, come on, EA. Oh, no. Nick Foles. Week 9 collectible. That's not good. We got Kwan Alexander. Not a bad middle linebacker. Uh, a nice a user, maybe. Possibly. 87 speed. 74 zone coverage. 76 block sheds. Not, not really that great. But solid uh, team of the week card. That's going to go for a little bit of coin because of that set. So I made a little bit of coin off of this pack opening. Um, definitely not going to do that well, I don't think. All right, let's see what we're going to get it. Come on, give us an elite. Oh, elite! Freaking kicker? A Justin Tucker kicker? 92 kick power, 87 kick accuracy. Dang it, man. I thought we were going to get something great. I thought we had a chance at a 48 hour. Okay, 86 overall Earl Thomas. So double elite pack right here. Oh, I thought we were going to clutch it out with the last one too. Earl Thomas... The third, 87 speed, 89 acceleration, 76 man, 88 zone with 73 hit power. I'm not sure what he's going for. Maybe around 40K would be my guess. Um, not bad. I think Justin Tucker's maybe like 10K or so. So this last pack sort of made us feel a little bit better. This is probably worth about 10K or so. Not bad. Not bad for a last pack. Finish it off strong. I thought this thing was worth like 10K, bro. This thing's worth 40 Okay. Holy cow. We're going to make some coin off of this. I was just coming out and clearing the binder space. And I saw this thing's worth so much. This thing is crazy expensive. I'm going to go ahead and throw them up. Um, what? For like... For, I'm going to throw them up for 40k. See if somebody buy it. I'll probably do like a uh, 30k buy it now. Or a bid. Maybe like... Yeah, 30k bid and maybe like a 40k buy it now, which is crazy. Who would pay 40k for a kicker? Maybe their value has gone up a little bit. I don't know, but that's definitely a nice pool. A lot better than I thought it was. Let's check Earl Thomas. I haven't checked him yet. What? No way. So, it's crazy. The kicker I pulled was worth more than Earl Thomas the third. Insane. He's worth half the price that I thought he was. Um, I could probably sell him pretty quickly, throwing him up for 20k. So that's what I'll do. <clears throat> I'm not too worried about having him on my team. Um, definitely is uh, some cards I'm going to look at now that I, I do get a little bit of extra coins from, uh, from pulling that pack. We'll see what I get. If you guys have any uh, players that I should definitely check out, uh, let me know. I'll put him up for 2500 um, I also want to see <clears throat> how much Quan Alexander is selling for. Let's see. I'm guessing 10K. It looks like about 9K or so. Yeah, 9K. Not bad at all. Definitely a solid gold card. It's it's crazy. We got a pretty decent pack on that last one. Something sold already. Um, <clears throat> so it looks like what's his face already sold. Our Earl Thomas the third sold pretty quickly actually. Uh, let's throw this guy up, and that will be the end of the video. Um, so far, I mean, that wasn't a bad, a bad last pack. That was a pretty good last pack. Um, definitely not expecting anything like that again, but it was nice that we did get something. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Drop a like on the video if you want to see a bundle. Make sure you let me know in the comment section, would you rather have the flashback bundle tomorrow or Saturday's bundle on Monday? You guys choose. Let me know down in the comment section down below. See you guys in the next video. Peace out. I'll give up the flat ring, it's high stakes, so gambling. Run the fade out the pocket, big speed, I'm scrambling. Check them to the core, there's no rewards if you can't handle it. We can hash it out to go for broke, it's your dismantling. I'll make your players look like a bunch of mannequins. We champions, do this on the regular like a bunch of shenanigans. What might have been the slightest bitch, I collided with Titans. This feeling like a scrimmage, don't get caught in the lines. Then you ain't gotta be fly like an eagle to build. E open the top schemes, I'm talking about big dreams. Can you build the vision match mine with it? I'm talking seismic. Ended up with time. Listen, my competition is slim. Picking you meal tickets. It's proven that I push limits. Learn to deal with it. We in the fist for the money. We bleed green. No retreating every single time. We will finish. <laughs>
this is this is this is welcome to the show